for watching. Um, clearly, if you clicked on this video, that's because you are interested in something that I am doing in less than 24 hours, which is getting gastric balloons put in. Well, the first, um, I'm doing the Ovalon system. Uh, mainly, this is a choice that I've made for myself because I, I can't do the weight anymore. I can't do it. Um, I have tried and tried and tried and tried. I'm 33. Um, I've tried just about everything. I've tried Michael Thurman's Total Body Makeover. I've tried, um, what was the one? P90X. Y'all, I held my breath while doing like a tricep thing on, <laughs> on doing P90X and threw my neck out. I said, you know what? This system is not for me. I've done Weight Watchers. Um, I tried to do Jenny Craig, but I actually have some issues with like gluten and she kicked me out the office. I've tried a weight loss assisted via my doctor, via like, hey, come on in and give us some money and we'll give you some pills. I have tried trainers, um, several trainers, multiple times. I've tried keto, I've tried paleo, I've tried Whole30. I've tried, low carb actually does work for me. Like I'm a living my truth. Like when I stick to it, it does work. However, if I could stick to it, like I wouldn't be the way that I am, right? Like, um, and really what's pushed me to this decision is my body is breaking down. Like as of right now, I do not have the BDs, but I just feel like I'm a ticking time bomb. Like I have back issues, my knee hurts, my ankle hurt. Like I was at home this summer cause I'm a teacher and I live overseas. And my dad was like, you walk like you're my age. And I was like, you know what? I do. And it's because my joints hurt. Um, so, yes, I have decided to get the gastric balloon. Um, like I said, I think I said, who knows what I said? Who cares what I said? I'm saying it now. Um, I'm getting the Ovalon system. I like that I can like kind of do two or three depending on how my body is adjusting. The other one I kind of gave some thought to was spats. Um, but I didn't like the idea of them having to go back in to adjust it. That made me really uncomfortable. The reshape was also one I considered. Um, it just really came down to like pricing. And I live, like I said, I live overseas. I live in Dubai. Um, insurance does not cover this. To give you a range of what I was looking at paying out of pocket, because I know that that's something I was looking for and everybody acted like they couldn't say it. Um, it ranged anywhere between 4000 on the low end to almost 7,900 on the high end. And that included everything. Uh, so tomorrow, is this thing not recording? Yo, what? no it is, I'm sorry. <laughs> Whoa, I was talking a lot and I was like, I see no numbers. I don't see anything telling me I'm recording. Um, so I'm going in tomorrow. I'll see the dietitian right before I go in and then I'll get the procedure. I'm awake during it, I swallow the pill. Um, because obviously we're overseas and the practices are a little different. I know some people who get this done in the States, they get like a trial pill to see how they do with that. They don't do that here. They're like, we'll send you a WhatsApp. You come on in and you're all set. Um, I did get all my medicine. I will be taking right before I go in tomorrow. This is the anti-nausea. Um, they gave me anti-spasmatic -sp pills. And they also gave me um, pant. Oh, this one's for acid reflux. Yeah, but I've always had acid reflux. Uh, I get the GERD all the time. So that one, I basically already had it anyway. Um, so tomorrow I'll take the the big one before I go in because that will help them to get it down. And then they send me on my way. And stay tuned. I will do current weight and goal weight. Never. No, I'm kidding. Um, I want to lose about 40, 45, 50 pounds. Um, so I will be following low carb um, while I'm doing this. I also do intermittent fasting. I've been doing that for about three to four months. When I do it with low carb, I actually see the results. When I don't and I just like eat whatever I want, I'm able to maintain my current weight, which um, is not a terrible thing to maintaining, not the weight I'm at. Like, girl, you paying all this money, you have to lose weight? No, no, I'm not. Um, so with intermittent fasting and the balloon, I think I should see some pretty good results. Of course, they always tell you, you can expect to lose about anywhere between 20 to 40 pounds. Um, I wanna do better than that, but <laughs> I will take anything that I can get. So with my procedure being tomorrow, right now I'm on a liquid diet, um, but I cheated. See? <laughs> I can't get right. But I said, you know what? I just want a few sour Skittles. Just a few. I shouldn't have had them at all. 
Um, also, it is almost 2 p.m. here and I've only had sour skittles and water, so I actually do need to put something in my body soon. But with intermittent fasting, I don't get hungry as often, so I'm hoping with the balloon that I'll really be able to restrict my calories, if I'm being quite honest. Um, because I don't tend to eat until, if I'm at work, about 11.30, but usually I eat between 12 and 8 or 11 and 7, depending. Um, also, I went out last night. That's when I'm a little raspy. But cocktails count on my liquid diet, right? No, probably not. Let me stop lying to myself. Starting tomorrow, I'm not lying to myself anymore. Y'all gonna help me, right? Um, I think that's about it. Um, I'm really excited. I'm not nervous at all. Literally, what I told my sister is I have nothing to lose but weight. My sister got um, the gastric sleeve about a year ago, and she left me behind. And so... I was like, if she's worried about it, I need to be worried about it. So um, here we are, and stay tuned. I will update. I will try at least once a week, um, but I'm a full-time teacher and a part-time, you know, procrastinator. So if it doesn't happen, be patient with me. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I will answer whatever I can. Um, and that's about it. I'll see y'all hopefully, you know, a little We'll hope the nausea. Oh gosh, I do not want to vomit at work. Hopefully, we'll be all right. We gonna we gonna put it up to the universe that we gonna work through this. Um, and I'll see y'all on the other side.